Hey guys, what's up? And welcome back to Let's Play The Sims 3 Seasons. Ooh, Riley received a small holiday bonus of 366 simoleons, and Sarah received a large holiday bonus of 1,409 simoleons. Snowflake Day has arrived. Share a friendly gesture with your neighbors, friends, or even to a stranger at the Winter Festival. Today is the day to spread some holiday bliss. Okay, so I do have some plans for today. For the first half of the day, we will be at the Winter Festival doing activities and gaining skills. And for the second half of the day, we will be back at our house throwing a gift-giving party and all of that awesome stuff. Holiday cheer, winter is the f... f, f <laughs> what is wrong with me? Holiday cheer, winter is the... Is winter is feeling the spirit of the season. She's ready for a little peace on earth and goodwill towards Sims. Awesome. I had a little brain fart there. I couldn't even read the text for some reason. Okay, but I'm gonna go ahead and... Camille, why are you up? Go back to bed. Yes, go back to bed and finish getting your sleep. But I am going to go ahead and put this on speed three and wait until somebody gets up in the morning, I guess. I mean, there really isn't anything to do because no one's up. I mean, we could follow Winter around because we don't actually need to buy cat stuff. So we could always buy cat stuff. Oh, it's Sarah's birthday today. She embarks on the next stage of life's great adventure. Why not buy her a birthday cake and throw her a party? Awesome, awesome, awesome sauce. Camille's getting up this morning. She's hungry, so she's going to go ahead and make some food. Or probably get leftovers. Yes, get leftovers was the correct guess. Sarah is up. No, Riley's actually up before her. I'm really surprised about that. Um, he's tired, so we're gonna go ahead and put Luke right back in his crib. Come downstairs, and you can make yourself some breakfast or grab some out the fridge. I really don't care. Grab some lobster thermidor because that's awesome and that's a high level, so that'll fill you up. But Camille is. Why, why do you do the strangest stuff? Like, you randomly just start reading a book. Like, clean up, girl. Your, your house is a mess. You really need to clean. And then you, you can go ahead and take a shower. And you can use the restroom. And winter. Stop it. Stop scratching. Bad. Stop scratching. No, you're not doing that. Oh. Can you scold the damn cat? Scold for being destructive and scratching. And then I want you to... Let me see here. Praise for... No, and then scold for being hyper. You can't be doing this stuff in our house. We love you, Winter, but you gotta be a good kitty, so... Yeah, be a good kitty for me. There you go. You need to learn. We want you to be a good kitty. Our new Quipsol. There we go. There we go. Okay, you're hungry, so go ahead and grab some food. And just grab some goopy carbonara, because why not? Why not? He's hungry. Winter, winter, winter. You need to get your scratching up. So we're gonna have you... Um... I would have you scratch... Oh, you can't scratch the mailbox. You're a kitten. You can't even get down the stairs. So... Oh my god, what are you scratching now? Stop scratching. Mom saw that. Scold for being destructive and scratching. And you're not gonna awe because you didn't do anything good. And then praise for... No, and then scold for being hyper and running around. You're not gonna do that. No. You're not gonna do that. I will not tolerate that. So scold this damn cat. You can go ahead and clean up those dishes. Yes, clean up the dishes. Okay, let's go ahead and head into build buy mode here because we need to buy some stuff for this cat. Let's go ahead and get the automatic litter box because the automatic litter box is actually really cool. I don't know where to put it though because we're out of room in this damn house. Oh, we can put it right there. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Okay, um, I don't think we can get any pet, uh, any uh, toys. So I think we're just going to have to skip on that. Um... Perhaps we can get one of those things just in case, but I don't think she'll be able to play with it because she's a kitten. We can always get a cat condo. We can get a blue one. It'll match the walls, but I don't know where to put it. Hmm. We can put it upstairs, but I don't think she's going to play with it until she um, ages up. But we're still going to put it upstairs anyway because when she ages up, she will have something to play with. So, oh, why not? So, let's go ahead and put it right up here. And I think that's all we need. I think we're good to go. We got the litter box. We've gotten everything. So, we're good to go. Um, You can come over here and use your litter box. I want to see you use it. Let's go. Let's go. 
There you go. I want to see you use your litter box. She's actually about to gain her cooking skill, which is nice. Oh, cool. <laughs> so, scolded, being scolded isn't the greatest feeling in the world. With her, should be more aware of her behavior, at least for now. Jeez, I heard that. I heard that. Okay, well, we need to buy a scratching post because I forgot to get one. <laughs> So let's go ahead and get one. Um, come outside and scratch. Congratulations, Sarah. Just improved her cooking skill to level four. Sarah cannot prepare spaghetti and sushi. Now may be a good time to hook it to the fishing skill. Check the bookstore for new recipes as well. So we're going to have her gain a relationship with her stepfather because they actually don't have a relationship. And I'm really surprised by that. So you can go ahead and make a silly face. Show a funny video. Show a gross video. Show an internet cat's video. Funny story. And just keep being funny, because being funny gains your relationship <laughs> the quickest. <laughs> Plus, it's all about family. It's spending time with family. That's what it's all about. He's not blood-related, but he's still family. He takes care of you and everything, so... That doesn't mean we get to treat him any worse. <laughs> Go ahead and have your pancakes. And she can actually kick it up a notch now, which is really nice. What is your issue? I don't care. You really did you really just put down pancakes so you can complain about being hungry? That's so stupid. That does not make a lick of damn sense. Eat those pancakes and shut your mouth, Sarah. I'm so sick of you. That's right, cough. Cough. Who keeps calling? We don't have time for you. We really don't have time for you. Clean up. Clean up. Yes, clean up those dishes. And then I want you to go ahead and kick it up a notch and put away. And we're going to have her go ahead and get ready. Use the restroom. And then we'll be just about ready to head out. What? Oh, my God. Call the repair technician. We got enough money for it. That's really irritating. That really is irritating. Tell a funny story. Um, we can show an internet cat's video. Show a gross video. Funny video. Make a silly face. Funny story. Um, we'll cancel off the last one so that we can teach Camille to drive. And then after she's finished using the restroom, then we're going to head to the Winter Festival. Move out the way. We got to pee. I'm so sick of you. Damn cat always in the way of everything. And then pay the bills. Get the mail. And then we're going to have you head down to the Winter Festival. So that we can do some winter activities. Wash your hands. Come on. There we go. Head outside here. Alright, get whatever's in the mailbox. Oh, Sarah just got a gift in the mail from Christopher. Interesting, interesting. Okay, here we go. We're gonna head down to the Winter Festival. And it actually stopped snowing, but everything looks absolutely amazing. 24 degrees. It's freezing cold outside. And we got tons and tons of snow on the ground. All right, here we are. We are at the Winter Festival. Let's go ahead and do some stuff here. Let's pause it so we can give it a chance to load up. Because there is tons of stuff going on here at the Winter Festival. Um, you can go ahead and skate. There ain't nothing wrong with that. So go ahead and do a little bit of ice skating. Come on, let's go, let's go, let's go. And they're going to learn how to drive. Here we go, yeah. Hopefully they don't slide. I don't think it's a good idea to teach your your stepdaughter how to drive in the snow, but who cares? Call a babysitter, because nobody's home at the moment. She looks so pretty. Aww. Uh-oh, don't fall. Don't fall. All right, let's see what we can do here. Uh, there can't be any skaters on the skating rink. Well, that's stupid. I don't know who this girl is, but we are making her smile, so that's all that matters. Watch them fall. I have a feeling they're gonna fall. Aww. Uh-oh! 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 Uh -oh. No! <laughs> that's not good. Sarah's feeling the Absolutely. spirit of the season. She's ready for a little peace on earth and good word, goodwill towards <laughs> Sims. Uh -huh. Aw. Okay, so they're learning how to drive. We gotta find out where the hell they are. Oh, jeez. Her fun is going down so quick. She is feeling stressed. Now, she probably won't learn in one sitting, but at least we've gotten started. So, let me go ahead and get some pictures here. 
Come on, speed it up a little bit. Oh my god, it's already sunset. Holy crap. That's winter for you. Um, your tire was just, like, turned, and it was twitching. I think there's, yeah, I think there's something wrong with your car. Uh, you're, like, struggling to go down this hill. Please don't slide. Come on, drive a little faster. There we go. I'm tired of you going so damn slow. Sarah's so not confident enough to start doing spins on the skating rink. Oh my gosh. Look at her. She's skating around with ease. Spin, spin. I want to see her spin. I want to see her spin. So she can now spin on the skating rink. And this is what this looks like. Oh, it looks so beautiful. Oh, he's spinning too. Sarah's paid 196 million for personal time off. Uh -huh. Wow, Sarah is really getting the hang of skating. She can even skate backwards. Uh -huh. Learning how to drive is an exciting yet embarrassing ride for no. Patrick. Any team you've taken uh -huh. the first step towards independence, it will take time and extreme patience, but it will be worth it in the end when Camille earns her driver certificate. So we're going to have her go ahead and skate backwards since she's now skating around the rink with ease. Look at her. Oh my gosh. And it is snowing again. It looks so beautiful. I love winter time. Oh, that's nice. So they're still learning how to drive. I guess we can just let them go until they can't do it anymore. And then I guess we're going to have them. Oh my god, we were supposed to throw our gift-giving party. Oops. <laughs> we were supposed to throw our gift-giving party. Alright, we're going to go ahead and skate forward. We can, like, switch simultaneously, which is really cool. We can go forward. We can go backward. Back to forward again. And then back to backward. Like, I think that's pretty freaking awesome. You can just switch as much as you want. Forward. I think there's too many people on the thing. That's why I can't change anymore. So he's at home, and she's at home. We're gonna have him go ahead and throw the gift-giving party. Actually, we're gonna have her throw it. No, do not receive a text. You can head home, and then you can throw... A party. Oh, you it won't even let you throw a party? What? I guess we have to be at home for it. Yeah, I guess we have to be at home for it. So hurry up. Alright, come on, get off. Get off the skating rink and head home in your little blue crappy slappy jalopy with your bent antenna. <laughs> it is freezing cold, 21 degrees outside. When does spring begin? Spring begins in three days, so just a few more days of snow and freezing coldness left to go before it gets a little warmer outside so she can go ahead and throw her party throw a party come on get on your phone we're gonna go ahead and throw a gift giving party it'll start we'll do casual attire invite our friends invite our co-workers let's see we gotta get the people with the highest relationships so we're gonna take our time here and get those we're almost friends with them, too. So, we gotta make sure to talk with them. Um, make sure we get Nancy Land grab. Um, you. I guess that's good enough. Okay, gift giving party will start. Awesome, awesome. So, gift giving party is gonna start at 8 p.m. So, we gotta clean up. We've got lots to do. So, clean the house. Um, that didn't count as. Hello? Clean it! Stop picking it up and dropping it! Oh my god. I don't have time for her bullshit. I really don't have time for it. And where are you going? What is going on? It's like everything's so glitched. How clean this damn house. Mop up some puddles, please. We got people coming over. And shit is just not cooperating. Oh my god, that's irritating. Okay, well we're gonna pick up this damn pile of clothes. Oh jeez, the first guest is here already. How freaking great. Put that in there. I'm getting sick of that. Are we going to get our pile of, um, presents? Poop. What a... Oh, okay. We just got it. Awesome, awesome, awesome. We're good. Alright, so we are ready. So, are people bringing food, too? I don't see anyone with food, but I think people are bringing food. Um, we can go ahead and come over here and 
call everyone to a meal here. Let's go, everyone grab some food. Everyone grab some food. We're having meal time now here. Meal time, meal time. What is this? Oh, hot and sour soup. This sounds nice and warm for this cold winter night. Everyone grab some hot and sour soup. Oh, jeez. Everyone's... Oh, jeez. Everyone's burning up. Oh my gosh, there's tons of presents. Call everyone to open presents. Alright, here we go. We're gonna open up presents, everyone. Riley just paid for personal time off. Oh my god, it's Sarah's birthday! Well, this is actually a good birthday, because look, we have everyone here. Everyone's cheering for her. Oh, Perfect timing, actually. Perfect timing. Oh. Sarah is now a fully mature adult. She'll need, she'll really need to think about establishing herself, establishing herself in her career and family life while there is still time. Oh, so we're gonna have to change her hair because she is looking really disgusting. Oh my god! Sarah is having a midlife crisis. Oh my god! I think our gift giving party is messed up, you guys, because no one is grabbing any damn gifts. No, stop listening to people's complaints. I don't have time for this. We can't open gifts because you already called everyone to open gifts, even though no one is opening a damn thing. Everyone is not opening gifts. We need to find a way to put these damn presents somewhere so people can open them. Open the gifts. You guys gonna open up your gifts or not? Oh great, and the crying baby's in the mix too. That doesn't help. Come upstairs and put the damn baby in the crib. I'm so sick of this baby being out of the crib. Like, who keeps letting him out? Oh great, now a stranger has our baby. Alright, well I'm assuming that we're not having a gift giving party. <laughs> what a fail. Because no one's opening any gifts. Oh my god, no one opened any gifts. What a freaking fail. <laughs> what a fail. Just get out of the house. Get out of the house. Get out of the house, everyone. Stop crying. Shut up. Shut up. Shh. You're so loud. Shh. Change the diaper. Feed and high chair. No one even opened any gifts. That is just... Flop. Flop. Alright, well, we're gonna sell it then. Hey, 200 simoleons. We could use that. Eat. Please eat. Please eat. Clean up those dishes. There's tons of dishes everywhere. Just clean them up. And did the repair person even come? Hey, the party was a, was a success, and no one even opened any gifts. I'm really surprised by that. And you're sleeping. No, do not sleep. Get up and tend your needs. Um, shower, use the restroom. Stop complaining. You're always complaining. You're always complaining about something. Shower. Go shower. Then you can go ahead and attack with the claw. You can go ahead and toss in air. Tickle. And snuggle. And then we will put him to bed. Holy crap. She is going through a midlife crisis. That is not good. Alright, head to bed. Holy crap. It's crazy. Lots of stuff is going on. Lots of stuff is going on. We're coming! Stop banging! Stop banging! And why are you awake? Did you, wh why did you wake up? That was that was pointless of you. Use the restroom. Go to bed. Oh, apparently the baby's crying. I don't hear anything. Uh, Camille cannot sleep while Luke is crying. I don't hear any crying. But, you know, sometimes people hear things in their head. Okay, finally, head back to bed. Alrighty, 
Go ahead and start some laundry. Because why the heck not? Grab some laundry. It's gotta be tons of laundry upstairs. Alright, go ahead and start that. And then you're ready for bed. So come upstairs and head to bed. You guys, what a crazy part. I apologize for the craziness. Hopefully we get things in order. That party was a flop. So we might have to throw one again. But, yeah. <laughs> I'm going to end this part right here. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, give it a thumbs up and add it to your favorites. And I will talk to you later. Actually, what I'm going to do is I'm going to have her get up. And I'm going to have her change her hairstyle. Because that's going to bother me. So head into the mirror and change your hairstyle. Um, I'm going to change it to something a little bit different. Because... As you can. I don't want it to... I'm kind of tired of the custom content hairstyles. So I, I think I'm gonna, I'm gonna put her into a Sims 3 hairstyle, like a regular EA hairstyle. Please don't complain. I'm sick of the complaints in the comments of, I don't like this, I don't like that, oh the fuck well, build a fucking bridge and get over it, I don't care. I will choose for her, her what I wanna choose for her. I just hate when I make a decision and people are butt hurt because of it. Like, it, it just doesn't make sense to me. So I'm gonna choose a hairstyle. Let me see. I don't even know what to choose for her. I don't even know what to choose. Hmm, let me see. Hmm. I like that. That's nice. Let me keep looking here. Island Paradise hairstyles are nice, too. I like that one. Let me see what else we've got here. We can give her a season's hairstyle, because I don't think we've given her a season's hairstyle yet. I do like this one. You guys like this season's hairstyle? Oh, I do like this one a lot. I think we're I think we're gonna give her this one. And I think we're gonna put her hair back to its natural color, which was brown. This is her natural hair color. For those of you who don't know. Red is just a color that she dyed it. But yeah, her natural hair color is brown. And the baby's hair is red, which is really cute. But I think we're going to put it back to her natural brown. Change her hairstyle. Everything else looks nice. So we're going to go ahead and accept this here. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. And I'm going to end this part right here. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, give it a thumbs up and add it to your favorites. And I'll talk to you guys later. I love you all so very much. And I will talk to you in the next part. Bye, guys.